YSR-72 Dark Star will mean the end of all enemies. It's not science fiction anymore. The SR-72, also known as Dark Star, isn't just a rumored ghost in the sky, it could soon become the fastest and most fearsome aircraft ever built. Able to fly at speeds exceeding Mach 6, this hypersonic monster doesn't just break the rules, it rewrites them. If the SR-71 was the ultimate spy plane, the SR-72 is its unstoppable successor, designed not just to watch, but to strike. In a world where seconds can decide the outcome of a conflict, the SR-72 is built to outpace, outsmart, and outlive anything in the sky. So, why is it considered the endgame for America's enemies? Because once Dark Star is unleashed, there will be no place left to hide. Introduction, the birth of a legend. The SR-72 Dark Star is the direct spiritual successor to the legendary SR-71 Blackbird, a plane that could fly at Mach 3.3 and was nearly untouchable during its service. But where the Blackbird stopped, Dark Star begins. Developed by Lockheed Martin's Secretive Skunk Works Division, the SR-72 is rumored to be a hypersonic aircraft capable of Mach 6 or more, double the speed of its predecessor. This futuristic aircraft isn't just designed for reconnaissance, it's meant to be strike-capable, combining intelligence gathering with the ability to deliver devastating precision attacks. It's not just about seeing the enemy first, it's about eliminating them before they even realize they've been targeted. The need for the SR-72 stems from modern threats evolving at lightning speed. Enemy defense systems, radar, and missile technology are catching up. The U.S. needs something that can fly faster, higher, and smarter than anything else in the sky. That's why the Dark Star isn't just a plane, it's a revolution in warfare. Design and hypersonic speed. The SR-72's most defining feature is its unmatched speed. Expected to reach speeds over Mach 6, that's over 4,600 miles per hour, it could travel from New York to London in under 90 minutes. At that speed, traditional air defense systems are practically useless. Enemy radars may detect it, but they won't have time to react before it's already gone. To achieve such incredible velocity, the SR-72 is believed to use a turbine-based combined cycle engine, TBCC. This combines a traditional jet engine for takeoff and subsonic flight with a ramjet or scramjet engine for hypersonic cruising. It's a complex piece of engineering, but one that makes the impossible finally achievable. Every detail of its design serves speed and stealth. With a sleek body, sharp angles, and radar-absorbing materials, it's engineered to fly fast and stay invisible. No detail is wasted. It's a weaponized ghost in the sky, built not just to reach the battlefield, but to dominate it. Strike capability. Unlike the SR-71, which was purely for surveillance, the SR-72 will have offensive capabilities. It's not just a silent observer, it's a deadly hunter. Equipped with high-speed missiles or hypersonic weapons, Dark Star can strike targets deep behind enemy lines within minutes. This gives the U.S. military the ability to eliminate high-value targets before they even reach the battlefield. Command centers, missile sites, and enemy aircraft can be neutralized without warning. It's a shift in strategy, from reacting to threats to preventing them altogether. Hypersonic speed means there's no time for the enemy to launch countermeasures. It won't be like previous wars, where enemies had minutes to prepare. With Dark Star, it's seconds. Or nothing. That kind of speed and precision is what makes this aircraft a true game-changer. Stealth and survivability. Speed alone isn't enough. The SR-72 is also designed to be stealthy. Its shape and materials are crafted to avoid radar detection. Combined with hypersonic speed, it becomes nearly impossible to track, target, or intercept. This makes it one of the most survivable aircraft ever conceived. Traditional enemy air defense systems are built to detect and engage slower, more predictable aircraft. But against the SR-72, these systems are rendered useless. By the time a radar picks it up, it's already miles away. Even the most advanced surface-to-air missiles would fail to catch it. 
This combination of speed and stealth gives the U.S. a massive tactical advantage. It means Dark Star can fly missions over hostile territory without fear. It can gather intel, strike, and escape before the enemy even knows what happened. It's the ultimate example of modern air dominance, intelligence, and surveillance power. Even though it's a strike-capable platform, the SR-72's intelligence-gathering role is just as important. With advanced sensors and onboard AI, it can collect real-time battlefield data at a global scale. From mapping enemy movements to locating missile launches, it becomes the eyes of the entire military network. Because of its speed, it can be anywhere in the world in hours. This makes it ideal for time-sensitive missions such as tracking mobile missile units or locating hidden terrorist camps. And since it flies so high, it can cover huge areas from a single mission. More importantly, the SR-72 doesn't work alone. It's designed to integrate with satellites, drones, and command centers. The data it gathers feeds directly into military operations, improving the speed and accuracy of decision-making. In the world of modern warfare, information is power, and Dark Star delivers it faster than anyone else. Global impact and enemy deterrence. The mere existence of the SR-72 acts as a deterrent. Enemy nations know that once it's operational, their high-value assets, bunkers, missile sites, and command posts could be destroyed in minutes. And the worst part? They won't even see it coming. That kind of psychological pressure changes military planning worldwide. Nations will have to rethink how they build and protect their defense infrastructure. It puts adversaries on the defensive, forcing them to invest more in countermeasures that might never even work. For U.S. allies, the SR-72 sends a clear message, America still leads in air dominance. For enemies, it's a warning. War with the United States means facing weapons you can't outrun, can't see, and can't stop. That's why the Dark Star isn't just a plane, it's a strategic weapon of peace through strength. The future of hypersonic warfare. The SR-72 also opens the door to an entirely new era of hypersonic warfare. It's not just about building one powerful plane. It's about leading a revolution in speed-based defense technology. Other countries are racing to build hypersonic missiles, but the U.S. is preparing to launch full-scale hypersonic platforms. This could change everything from reconnaissance to air superiority and long-range strike missions. The ability to reach anywhere in the world in minutes redefines how wars are fought. No runway will be safe. No command center will be out of reach. The SR-72 isn't just preparing for the next war. It's changing what war will look like. It's turning speed into a weapon, invisibility into armor, and intelligence into precision. That's the kind of leap that only comes once in a generation. Outro. The SR-72 Dark Star isn't just another aircraft. It's the edge of the blade, the tip of the spear, and the future of warfare its speed, stealth, and strike power make it untouchable. Its presence alone changes the calculations of enemies across the globe. With Dark Star in the skies, wars won't start the same way, and they definitely won't end the same way. It gives the U.S. unmatched reach, response time, and firepower. And in a world full of rising threats, that kind of dominance isn't just important, it's necessary. So when we ask why the SR-72 could mean the end of all U.S. enemies, the answer is simple. Because you can't fight what you can't see, can't catch, and can't stop. What do you think about the future of hypersonic warfare? Let us know in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure to like, share, and subscribe for more amazing stories from the front lines of technology and defense.